Good evening YouTube, Brew By Me, back again. Gonna do my last review of the night, I think. Brew By Me, say brew, bbbiofly.com, talk to Brian, he'll hook you up. My simple malt glass. This is number 12 for tonight. Samuel Adams Spring Lager. Now, yes, it's out of season, but it's the last one I have and I figured I should review it. So. Without further ado, standard Samuel Adams cap, 5.5% ABV, 355 milliliter bottle, a bright citrusy unfiltered lager, yada yada yada, product of the United States of Canada. Um, basically their, brewer, their um, brewery is in uh, Massachusetts, Boston. They make... Uh, Samuel Adams is... Uh, they're as big as a macro, but their beer is better tasting than macro. Um, you know, with 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 uh, Samuel Adams, most of their beers are up here, um, whereas macros are down here. But at the same time, you got other beers that are up here. Um, so Samuel Adams is a decent all-around beer. Um, Every beer I've had from Samuel Adams has been good, if not terrific, so uh, can't complain. Spring Lager, 5.5% ABV. Let's give her a smell. Yeah. So it is a lager. It is a spring lager. Um, so what I'm picking up is a nice, sweet, malty profile up front, followed by your... Uh, slightly bitter hops kind of like a fresh cut grass kind of hop um, there is some citrus notes in there grapefruit and such um, smells good it looks good um, it's a dark straw in color it looks like it's unfiltered you know, two and a half fingers ahead, small to medium bubbles. Um, it's kind of like an off-white head. Uh, let's give her some more smells here. Yeah, oh, pink grapefruit. A little bit of floralness. Sweet malt. And that's about it. Um, you know, it smells good, it looks good. Let's give her a taste. Let's see what we think. Mm. This is, it is a really good beer. Like for what it is, a lager, it, it blows all the other lagers out of the water that are macros. Um, it's right up there with, um, well, not exactly like the Creamer Springs lager, but just under it. Um, it, it it's, it's a really well put together beer. Clean, crisp, refreshing, nice citrus notes, nice floral notes. Um, there is a hint of honey in there. Yeah, it's another one of those summer beers where I can sit down, drink 6 to 12, and I'll be fine. Um, uh, for malts, I'm picking up two row pale some crystal malt, some caramel malt, a hops, tetanog, that's it, that's all. Um, there's this, like I said, there is that nice citrus uh, character there, which makes it like a nice kind of a dry finish. Um, 
not much more I can say about this beer, but uh, if you guys could find it, well, you won't be able to find it now because uh, they're not brewing it anymore, but next uh, spring, give it a look and uh, see because it is definitely one of the beers that you should try. It is a definitely good lager. Um, no complaints. Somebody offered it to me. I would drink it. Yada, yada, yada. Anyways, please rate, comment, subscribe. Leave any suggestions or ideas in the comments box, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.